Uh, this model kit review is of the USS New Jersey. It is by Ravel. This is an older model and it is uh, 1 350th scale and shows some of the uh, finished model here some of the details and it's a very large box because it's a very large model and on the other side over here you can see from above as well as from the side how large a model this is going to be let's take a look inside and see what we've got so first of all Got some pieces, and looks like we've got the deck, and uh, there's a fair amount of surface detail here uh, for the wooden deck, and uh, looks like lots of parts will need to go on here. Here's the main hull, uh, which is not terribly well molded, lots and lots of flashing and mold lines everywhere but it's a very large model let's have a look here most of these pieces are uh, molded with some detail they do have some mold lines sort of throughout throughout uh, and a fair amount of flashing it's probably from the older molds and uh, here we have the uh, main tower for the ship. Also looks like we have some of the walls, some of the main guns, all with some surface detail, lots of flashing unfortunately. Here's some of the smaller guns also with some flashing. But there are a lot of parts to uh, put together here. Here's another main gun. This one also has a uh, boat with a giant ejector pin hole in it that will need to get filled. Some of the other smaller guns. Unfortunately with lots and lots of flashing. Here's another main gun. Here's the actual guns. And you can see the housings that go over top of them. Boot, here's our rudder. Another boat. Here it looks like this is part of our stand. And then this one, some, some of the other larger, the main guns, additional parts that go on top of the deck. Looks like a crane. And we have the helicopter that sits on the back. Here's its uh, main rotor. Here's a folded rotor. Lots and lots of additional parts here. Part of the tower. And our smokestack. And another boat. But all lots of details. Uh, here's our sign. Let's have a look over here at uh, the parts and bag. Looks like we have some parts we'll go on the deck there. And this looks like this is part of the stand. There's some of the flags, decals. Even though this is an older kit, this is actually still very nicely printed. It has not yellowed very much. Let's take a look at our instructions. It seems fairly thick. We have uh, a lot of things to do. Here are the uh, colors needed. It shows you how to paint the hole and deck. And there's the parts listing. All the remaining parts listings here.
begin. Begin with uh, putting together the uh, drive shaft for the uh, propellers and the and then the uh, upper deck with the bulkheads. And starting to build the bridge. Then the funnel gets put together. Some of the towers. Then uh, another bridge. Radar, masts, uh, lots of additional details coming on here. Try to build up the uh, main deck. Stairs going on. Funnel going on there. Some additional uh, defense mechanisms here. Some of the uh, lifeboats, inflatable lifeboats. And then the guns starting to be put together. And in range front, as all the different the main guns get put together too. So, all their additional details. Those then go on there. Main deck gets built up and placed on the pole. Here's our stand. Then the main uh, tower and the bridge and all the other parts go onto the uh, deck. Here's how to build the uh, different boats that go on the side of the ship. Anchors get put on, those are enormous anchors. Different uh, additional details on the deck. Lots and lots of extra little details. And here are the uh, Seahawk helicopters, the SH 60s. And there's some decals for those. And we have um, some masts getting put on. And in the flags. I didn't see any thread in the box, but I have thread from other ones. So, it should be easy to make uh, with that thread. Well, it looks like a fairly detailed model, very large, and uh, lots of little pieces.